Hi! I will show you how to filter out the buffs that show up in your UI to only show the specific ones that are relevant to you, that you can choose, and not just all of this stuff that you really don't want to see. We're going to do this with Elf UI. Elf UI is the reason why my UI looks the way it does. So let's open it up. You might be familiar with it. We're going to go to Unit Frames, uh, Individual Units, Player, and Buffs. We're going to enable that unit frame. So now this shows up above our uh, name. Um, good. You can adjust the size a little bit. I'll make it a slightly bigger because I have a very limited number of buffs that I want to show. And with this done, we're going to go to Filters. We'll create a filter. Name it whatever you want to name it. Um, and OK. And we're going to make the filter type a whitelist. To this tank, or to this filter, we can add spells specific buffs that we want to see. Uh, I want to see, for instance, since I'm a monk tank, I want to, I'm, I'm leveling this monk tank, we're still make, uh, creating it, um, I want to see specifically Iron Skin Brew to see if I can keep it up as much as I can. Now the tooltip shows an ID, and that ID is what we'll add in here, with this number. Okay, now it's in our filter. Give it a maximum priority. I really like this one. I want to add in another uh, another uh, buff. Um, for instance, I want to add in elusive brawler as well to see how much if that is up and you know, and how many how many uh, how much time is remaining on that. I'll add that ID as well and add it into the filter. Slightly lower priority. Okay. Now our filter is done. We're going to go back to unit frames, buffs. And we're going to scroll down and we're going to make sure that we add the filter that we've just created. Good. And by right clicking on the six other options here, we're going to remove them from this list. We'll only have our own filter remaining. Cool. Now that that is done, we're going to toggle the anchors and this player buffs thing, we're going to drag it into the corner of irrelevance. Toggle anchors again. And now we're pretty much set to go. I will uh, go in here and show how that works. The two buffs that are selected, you can add some more, um, will now show up. There you go. Elusive Brawler and my other Iron Skin Blue thing is showing. And now I can pay attention to this and try to sort of keep these buffs up as best as I can. There you go. That's it.